Whatever motivates people, we want to do what works. Governor Roy Cooper believes the chance to win $1 million will boost some of North Carolina's lowest vaccine rates based on success in other states and research from behavioral scientists. We are starting to lag behind. North Carolina's vaccine rate is about 50%. In census tracked 114 surrounding the Warnersville community in Guilford County, it's 25.9%. So why would you put a price on something that you claim is going to help us? So if it's going to help us, then it shouldn't be a price. Rachel Barr says $25 cash cards and the lottery drawing won't change her mind. She's still worried about the side effects from the shot. I'm in a place where I can't afford to be sick or to be broken down because I got people dependent on me. I got to help my own family. I got to help other families. Other people I talk to say incentives don't address mistrust in communities of color. And we've been done wrong for so long, been tricked into so many different things, especially the low income class. You know, so we, we don't know and we very scared. If the drawing does drive up demand in the state. The good thing is that we have plenty of vaccines. They are easy and they are everywhere. So we are ready. We want people to come and get a vaccine.